Uh, the center and the quarterback can play a little tight because of all that. If we can speed the tempo up, I think it'll loosen them up a little bit. And, um, and then the execution of it, just goodness, we, we've got to stay out of third and long. When we were in third and medium and short, we, were, we got all, all but one of them. So um, now it's a matter of getting into those more often and staying out. I think we were in seven or seven or eight third and longs. So that's hard to, hard to sustain drives. And then in the blue zone, you can score. And our run attack's got to be stronger and better. And we've got to be, we've got to execute better, make better decisions down there, and, and get points. We were there four times, I think, and we only came with points one time. So you got to come away with points every time you get in the blue zone, either whether it be a field goal or a touchdown. You got to come with points. Does that speak more towards your offense not executing correctly, or maybe Ole Miss's defense was that good? No, Ole Miss was great, um, and they did a lot of things that could cause third and longs. Because they were very good, but they didn't. I mean, we got in the blue zone. They didn't stop us from getting in the blue zone. I call them the blue zone. It's the red zone. Um, and now it's a matter of we had a snap over Jake's head, if you remember, and that took us out of field goal range. Um, we threw an interception, 14-point swing. They took it back for a touchdown. We missed a field goal. Those are three of the four. The fourth one we scored on. So, um, but we can't be a great football team. If if that's, what, you know, if that's how we're going to play. And I, I don't think we do that anymore. Transferring all that to now Texas prep for this coming yeah. Saturday, what's similar to Ole Miss as far as the defense goes? Athleticism and speed and, and uh, physicality. Uh, Ole Miss was, they were really good. They had improved a lot from last year. They made some personnel changes. They moved a corner to safety. And he was really, he's the one that picked off the ball and took it back from the touch. He was really good. Um, they had their uh, defensive end back that was a real talented player. And so there was, and then they had brought a new corner in from a junior college that added a lot of speed to their defense. And I think Texas is a lot like that: speed, um, physicality, you know, big, strong, athletic players. And then the scheme is, the scheme allows them to play fast. Uh, Coach uh, Manny Diaz does a good job down there, and those kids will be running around, flying around, blitzing and playing man to man, and then they'll roll off, they'll, they'll blitz and drop in the zone. And our kids are going to have to be on their toes.